In the days before air travel, the Bembridge ticket allowed London gentlemen an extra day to conduct their city affairs prior to leaving the country for vacation or other matters. The following four paintings illustrate how it was done around the year 1900. Painting 1. Embarkation at Tilbury Having purchased the special Bembridge ticket, a city gentleman could put his family aboard a liner early on its day of departure from Tilbury. He would then return to his appointment. Here we see Hiram Andrew Bifford, a master architect, bidding his wife fair passage until, in a short while, they are to be reunited. His two boys have their own exciting distractions at this busy waterway. Meanwhile, the ship is being loaded with some cargo and provisions for the voyage. Painting 2 Afternoon Departure from London after completing outstanding business on the same day, the gentleman would take the late afternoon train to Portsmouth, cross the Solent to ride, and catch the train to Bembridge. At the station, a last-minute deal is lodged, sealed by that all-important handshake. There are a few other passengers. They are fellow travellers and foundation to the dawning new century and an unfolding new world. But the station pigeons remain undisturbed. Mother with family fledglings. Painting 3, Bembridge Railway Station and Spithead Hotel. At Bembridge, the luxurious Spithead Hotel offers top quality cuisine and a comfortable night. Mr. Bifford is squaring up with the porter as other passengers scurry by. The evenings are drawing out and still a little chilly, but then, as it pokes through the picket fence, the brave Forsythia knows better. As this season swings, so does the engine on the terminus turntable. Groves are building high fair summer is promised. Painting 4. Rendezvous by pilot cutter at Smith Head. The next day a gentleman could rejoin his family aboard their liner at Smith Head by means of the pilot cutter which was sent from Bembridge to disembark the ship's pilot. Reunion is at hand. Hiram A. Bifford signals his arrival as the pilot leaves the ship. Only a scary ascent of the ship's ladder. 
is there lower access before he's back with his family? So that was the memory ticket. Did you notice something hidden? This set of canvases was commissioned by a valued patron who provided the information. His early recognition to my work deserves my thanks. As in life, one thing leads to another. So it happens with art. There came a couple of follow-on pictures to the Bembridge ticket. These were Living Steam and Toy Train, both illustrating the railway station at the turn of the century. In fact, it was my initial visualisation sketch for Toy Train that I've used for this short presentation. I hope you found it interesting and thanks for watching.